Strictly Come Dancing is said to have signed up a British icon as plans for this year's lineup gets underway. The BBC dance competition will return later this year and while the official roster of celebrities hasn't been revealed yet, rumours have been swirling around those set to take part. It has been reported businessman David Fishwick has been approached by Strictly bosses and has told his pals H has signed up for the show. He made his fortune selling minibuses before going on to set up a community bank lending out his own money following the 2008 crash. Burnley Savings and Loans was set up the same year, helping people in the Lancashire town who were struggling to get loans following the banking crisis. David went on to become the subject of Netflix series Bank of Dave as well as a Channel 4 documentary. The CEO could soon be stepping onto the dance floor. Strictly think his inspiring backstory will win him new fans on and shine a spotlight on the amazing work he has done for people and business in Lancashire, a source told The Sun. Dave has told his friends he has accepted and cannot wait to get started. They said the opportunity is a dream come true for Dave and added, he is a working class man who did well for himself and decided to use his success to help others. Dave left school at 16 with no qualifications and set up his minibus company. He then founded Burnley Savings and Loans in 2011. Netflix made a film about his life last year, starring Rory Kinnear as Dave and a sequel is already planned for 2025. Last year, Dave pledged to give away the vast majority of his multi-million fortune after death to keep his kids humble. He admitted it would be burdening to let his children rely on inheritance, and is planning to leave 99% of his wealth to help those less fortunate. It's so important that the children work hard because I have seen lots of people who have become successful and wealthy and they spoil their kids and the kids have no understanding of money whatsoever, he told Daily Star. I am going to give 99% of my wealth away when I pass away, whatever week, year it is. Hopefully it's a long time away. He said his wealth will all be going back to society so he doesn't burden his future generations with enough money so they don't have to get out of bed in the morning. Over the years, Dave has lent £27 million to people and businesses to get their ideas off the ground, with all profits going back into supporting others.